Brain Awareness Week is a fantastic opportunity to highlight the difficulties of the hidden disability with hydrocephalus. The fact that hydrocephalus is hidden and very, very complex, the effects of hydrocephalus can vary from one person to the next, and it is difficult for people with hydrocephalus because quite often they don't know about the difficulties. And then I find here with our work here that people here love to learn about the difficulties of hydrocephalus and things that they didn't know about and reasons why they do things that they do. For instance, if motivation is difficulty and they think, Oh, I'm just lazy and say so, well no it's not laziness it's because of your hydrocephalus and how it's affected your brain and they really find it very empowering to learn about all these things and then to actually put it into a practical sense and overcome the difficulty by just doing everyday activities. I'm so many years ago I've been because I have hydrocephalus and I'd like to improve myself and I don't know my disability is getting better with me. Like I don't let it hold me back. I take my job right. I can do these things. I'm going to get out and do what I can. And if I have difficulties on my thing, I feel like I'm getting more confident in things. I'm not, I'm not afraid to say what I feel anymore. Or, and it's just one of these things I've had I've never thought I'd see the day that I've been able to do. It was a different from yourself. If you have something you want to try, give it a go. I've witnessed day in and day out people with hydrocephalus discovering skills that they never imagined that they had. And initially, when the opportunity is offered, they'll say, oh no, 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 I, I, I couldn't do that. I have hydrocephalus, I, it's difficult for me, I, I can't. And I'd say, okay, fine. And then maybe after a few weeks, they'll say, look, I'm, that looks kind of fun. Maybe I'll join and I'll try it. And then they realize, oh, that actually, I could do this or I can do this. Sometimes with uh, hydrocephalus, I still struggle with direction and type on though, help me with that. The sense of achievement is huge then. And then very empowered, very confident and can reach different goals and aims, be it to be an artist or to drive a car or, something very small like go to the shops alone and get your shopping. The list is endless that you can, if you think you can't do it, you can. It's always possible, there's always a way. With hydrocephalus, it is, it is tough trying to get on with your daily activities and trying to be independent as best as you can. In the beginning when I first came over here, that um, I was nervous to ask, could I do this, could I do that? And before you know it, you'd be out doing little businesses for yourself. We all need encouragement, we all need great support behind us, so go ahead, ask for, ask for advice and don't be afraid. I would say, you know, to anyone who, who has those difficulties to get involved with us, contact us, we're there to help. We can help you on the road that you want to go, but always go for your dream and reach out to somebody and look for the help and don't be feeling alone.